Well, Junior, just a couple of days away from London Welsh and the start of a new cup competition for the boys. You must be excited. Uh, yeah, I am pretty excited. I haven't played for about a month and uh, you know, everyone else in the team is excited just to get out there and finally play some rugby. I was going to say, it's a chance for, for you to, to state your claim with the bosses and that um, in, a, in a competition which has a lot of worth at the end of the day, the Heineken Cup place up for grabs. Yeah, um, definitely. Uh, you know, uh, the coaches talked about uh, uh, at the beginning of the week about you know playing well. It's pretty hard playing well in these kind of games where not everyone knows their role and not everyone's played together. So, you know, the guys that stand out and perform really well, you know, they could you know uh, put up their hand for selection in the top team. So, you know, we all pretty much want to be in that, uh, be involved in the top team and, and you know and just play really well this weekend. London Welsh, as we know, can be a tough nut to crack as, as, as we saw in the Premiership. What are you expecting from them this weekend? Yeah, I watched uh, the game last week against Bath, and you know they did really well. Um, you know, they managed to score that that win and end. Um, they're a team that you know that never backs down, and they'll go for the full 90 minutes even. And uh, you know we're prepared for that. We know what they're going to bring, and uh, we've done our analysis. And um, I think uh, you know just the excitement and the energy that and the hunger that the boys will bring on on Sunday will definitely um, you know will get a result. Looking at, the, looking at the squad, Junes, there's a nice uh, blend to it, a, a mix of experience with yourselves and a few others, Budgie, with the youth coming through as well. Uh, does that excite you? Yeah, it does, actually. You know, it's a great opportunity for, for everyone involved and especially, you know, someone uh, like me with a bit of experience to help out the younger guys. I've got young Slady playing outside me at 10, so, you know, I'm hoping that he could, you know, learn a few things. And also, you know, it's just... Uh, brings the best out of everyone, you know, uh, especially the young ones, knowing that you know they've got some older heads in the team. You know, there's not going to be anyone panicking out there. We all know, all know our roles and all know what to do. So, yeah. People talk about the youth coming through and the academy working. I think we've seen that with the A League and now in perhaps competitions like the LV Cup. Yeah, there's a lot of potential with the the guys in the academy and the young ones um, coming through, and uh, you know it's great to see. And you know, hoping uh, they could really put in a real good performance on Sunday to you know, try and stake the claim for you know for next year or the year after but I think it will be a great uh, learning experience for them. Looking at the uh, the DVDs this week you would have done your homework on Welsh what are you expecting from them? Um, just a lot of uh, I don't think um, you know they, like I said before they went back down and uh, you know they, they bring a lot of uh, physicality around the ruck era and uh, we've uh, practiced that uh, yesterday on a and how we're going to counter that at, at rock time. You know, uh, they like to get real niggly and stuff, so... And um, you know, they've got quite a few uh, powerful runners in, in their forward pack, so we're just uh, looking forward to getting out there and uh, playing some rugby. Great, thanks, James.